Maybe I'll just throw this on the end of the video. We were doing the splitting of the logs with uh, the wedge here. It's quite a few hours later. But maybe I thought I'd share this with you. Um, when you're sawing, <coughs> when you're sawing the big logs and you get these daggets hanging off, these bow daggets, whatever they're called, I don't know what they're called. Normally, I don't. <laughs> This is bad now. Normally, uh, I don't get them this big, but uh, what I do with these, you know, it makes it hard to baton, right? Especially if you've got them on both sides. But I will actually break these, and then these are great to trim down and use as your, um, your very small kindling pieces to help get the fire started. So, uh, one thing to do, though, is don't hit them. Here. Don't hit them this way because then they break off around this area and they don't work as well. Turn it over and it'll continue splitting it down the back. Uh, this is actually a large one compared to what it normally, normally happens. Generally speaking, uh, they come out half the size, but this is still very, very workable. You can baton this stuff down very easily and uh, use it for the beginning of your fire. Honestly, a lot of the times they, they'll come out more this size. That one was just quite abnormal compared to what I normally get. But again, they'll come out this size and then you can really just baton these down. I mean, look, it's starting already for you. And use those for the fire in the beginning process. So just a thought, some of the things that I do while I'm out here.